easy, that's the way. Steps into the season, a new National Football League record. What a great route, too. Look at all the work that he had to do at the line of scrimmage to get away from Logan Ryan. You're going to play man-to-man -man defense against this guy. There is a good chance you are going to lose. Drew Brees, again, recognizes the coverage that they're in. Conversation after this play. Like I said, that matchup there is, is awfully good, but... set this up right at the point of the break. He takes his time. He never gets in a hurry there. So many young receivers, they just take one step and break out of it. And a veteran like Desmond Trufant will reach. It's the middle linebacker. Now, where do you think he's going to see? Where do you think he's going to go? And you can't, that's putting Devin White in a tough position. And Devin can help himself if he's going to play that little route, not to look back at the quarterback because a guy like Michael Thomas will pull away from you if you're staring. It's a man-to-man -man defense. Sean Smith, free agent, goes to shoot. But look at the route by the young player using his hands to get free. And then after the catch, you got to maintain your leverage if you're Sean Smith. Off in New Orleans works in tandem with these two. Kamara breaking to the outside and a really physical route by Michael Thomas who takes Akello Witherspoon and essentially throws him inside when Witherspoon tries to body him up downfield. That uncovers him in a big way. And now he finishes things off. I'm telling you, whatever his field goal, and, and it was really the connection between Taysom Hill and Michael Thomas. So we'll see if this starts to become a little bit more of a part. They're going to put Michael Thomas in the slot. And however they try to double him, just going to try to fit the ball in there. Good throw there. And again, the understanding. Drew Brees knows when he needs a completion, this is the guy that he's going to. That came into the and, and you get leverage, then you're going to beat him across the field if you have any kind of speed. And that's what Thomas is able to do. There's no chance for Rose. Let's take another look at it. This is going to be... Pass interference. Defense number 22. I, mean, I just love what Michael Thomas is doing. It's man-to-man -man coverage. If you're going to show Drew Brees and Michael Thomas they are going to shred you. Just can't do it. If you're Romeo Cornell, the defensive coordinator, you're going to have to mix your looks up. NFL best 125 catches a year ago. Then he comes out on Monday night, catches 10 more for 120 something yards, and that's just a good job by him. You know, understanding where the whole man is 26. Thomas shaking up. DJ White filling in admirably until he wasn't because Michael Thomas runs right through the down at the bottom. This is easy for the quarterback to see. The safety comes down. Teddy Bridgewater doesn't have a lot of looks like that today. That's one on one. You don't even look at anybody else. Look at the separation right there. I mean, watch. He's one on one, third and three. He's got six yards of room just to throw a simple pass. I mean, that's. He's so good. Watch this route. Not only is he quick and big and physical at the top of his route he snaps it off as good as any receiver in the nfl and he allows him to create separation even against good coverage and of course Drew Brees. brown on the coverage and this was the thing that the cowboys really beat up these saints receivers when they played a season ago in that 13 to 10 game and they knew in order to get the cowboys off of them they had to start hitting some of those kinds of plays that back shoulder Again, he lined up in the slot. He can go outside and run those fade routes. Quick move inside. The double team him. Jermaine Brock in man-to-man -man coverage. Look at 31. Bayard trying to get over the top to double him up, but still trust all his release. Now, he's not the fastest guy in the world, but his route running is so crisp and clean. He bends his hips every time he comes out of the ball, so he's so efficient on how he plays receiver that he plays at a much faster speed. Well, you see inside right here, Thomas, he knows it's man-to-man -man because of the outside, so he just takes it right now. Stay on top of Michael Thomas. He's on top of Michael Thomas, so that's a read between Drew Brees and Michael Thomas because he's on top. Drew Brees is automatically going to put that ball just beautifully behind. Michael Thomas knows to slow his route down. 
And that's just two guys working together in here. Just a big wide receiver, but he's not the fastest guy, but he's extremely quick. He does a good job of using his hands. Just a little stem right there and throw it up high where the defensive back can't get him. They can expose that matchup all day, Coach. And Drew not throwing right from the pocket. Just the Michael Thomas on the inside, and this is what you're going to have to take your opportunities down the field when you see him. They get the man-to-man -man coverage that time, and a nice throw by Teddy Bridgewater. Well, Thomas had a huge game in last year's opener with the Bucs. A club record 16 catches for 100. It's coming in to this game, and he's got incredible savvy. You see how he sold the go route and then put his foot in the ground. He'll get the ball to Michael Thomas. He almost slipped coming out of his break, but he was wide open. And this is the tire. The next one is history. So three receptions on this drive, two from Brees, one from Hill. Did not see that coming from Taysen. Taysen. <laughs> How to execute football play. Watch Thomas's first move when he gets in the route. He has to be patient, and Drew looks and goes to the back of the end zone, hoping to get a chance to smite his challenger. He's very difficult. He's a bigger receiver against Desmond Trufant, and he's got those strong hands that Sean Lee talked about. So Breeze understands now he's one-on-one, -on -one and wow, great cut right there to get outside on Jenkins. Perfectly thrown ball. Jenkins with great defense, but oh, he's in. Great. Look at that, just a, just took that easy access. You got Isaiah Oliver over there playing on top of him. Range. It's a slant and go, boom, and over the top. Drew Breeze gets him with the shoulder on Bradbury, and all he's looking at is Michael Thomas to Camaro. Here we go. Listen, I, I, I've got so much trust and confidence in him, and uh, we've got a lot of time on task together. Three receivers that run this type of route because it takes a lot of time on task. But Drew Breeze feeling really good about going to the ground out of bounds. That's a nice job. Ball's out, you know, and then to be able to make the catch. Four already. Yeah, Thomas, not the speedster, and yet when you get into these contested catches, back shoulders, you just have to stay. Not as glamorous as you might expect, but a good route. Look at the the, the in and out movement, and then back in. Well, very good off the line of scrimmage. He's going to run an escape route here, where he has the option to go inside, come outside. One of the New Orleans, one of their staple throws. Very, very aggressive on the football. We watched him on the sideline before the game. It was, man, he was just attacking the football.